Francisco to Terry Moran on the scene in Ukraine. Good morning, Terry. Good morning, George. Today is National Unity Day here in Ukraine. President Zelensky set this day for people across the country to come together, fly flags, sing the national anthem in an act of solidarity and defiance on the exact date predicted for a Russian attack. Zelensky himself taking to Instagram on a selfie video and declaring nobody can love our home as much as we do. Nobody can defend our home as much as we can. Later, he told the BBC Ukraine does not see signs of a Russian withdrawal yet. Uh, we went to the Unity Day ceremony at the National Military Academy here where the cadets say they are ready to fight. But most Ukrainians, I've got to say, remain calm, almost nonchalant about the situation, in part because President Zelensky has made preventing a panic here a top priority uh, to protect the economy, which is getting hammered. But U.S. officials tell us they are concerned that Zelensky is not doing enough to protect his people and prepare them for what might come next. In the old city today, I asked a man well, what he made of President Biden's speech. He said, this is America's game. This is Russia's game. It is not our game. George? But they are in the middle of it. Terry Moran, thanks very much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.